hello everyone welcome back to our channel eduotic so in the series of origin 2025 or 2024 today we are going to learn about how to plot ci diagram the ci diagram is basically used to represent a reflectance characteristics or transmitted characteristics all or pl characteristic in a visual appearance okay from one particular reflectance spectra over the 360 nanometer to uh, 750 nanometer we can represent those point in the ci diagram and interpret it its color okay Sa color saturation that means in this perspective hue and saturation will be there so you can interpret those things and in uh, increase your visibility in the paper or your scientific data for that what we have to do for that you just need to import your reflectance spectra just like here you already know how to import those data so for uh, the first video how to plot graph uh, those things those basic thing has been covered already or maybe you know that thing so for that i have uh, just normalized my uh, data at various angle i am going to plot my reflectance characteristic at various incidence angle and then these are my uh, normalized data so i need to select all the column and for that you need to plot the uh, chromaticity diagram in the pro version you need to see the apps so in the apps there will be see chromaticity diagram so you need to click there so when you click there this kind of window will be there where xyz lab and pl will be there so you need to click this pl that means photoluminescence yeah. so photoluminescence spectra here written as and these are what these are the columns selected columns and then you need to specify it's the spectral type is radiance or it is a reflectance or transmittance accordingly then you need to specify your uh, power distribution or illuminant d65 this 50 a or custom type so the standard observer is ci 30 1931 or ci 1964 and the graph type ci 31 or ci 1976 and the plot type you will choose accordingly okay yeah. now then okay so i have some issues so in this uh, student version you have only uh, how many only uh, 12 uh, tapes will be there so i'm going to show you my original one that is so those are the points that means from one reflectance spectra over a wavelength scale at a particular incident angle i have got at 30 40 is this 20 is this so at varied uh, angle of incidence my coloration aspect of the same sample will be different so from this data i can get an idea about what i i get an idea about the spectral distribution of my sample or the color distribution of my sample so this is uh, this diagram is very useful to represent uh, angle of incidence that means the iridescence data colorimetric sensing and uh, um, temperature variation with uh, variation of uh, coloration with respect to temperature so if you want to give the uh, color temperature bar so you need to click there so this is the color temperature bar which is also going to be useful for black body radiation type of data so you need to see accordingly for my case in my study i only use those um uh, those uh, reflect uh, those ci diagram for to represent the coloration aspect of the specimen or the sample so if you want to plot the uh, the plot uh, if you want to plot ci diagram with color temperature then you need to specify the scale and accordingly you find the coordinate to convert it to the uh, color temperature okay no uh, for this video that's all and thank you for watching the video please subscribe to the channel or give us some comment to improve our quality of the video thank you so much